talking about battery uh, backup, but the battery review for the much talked about phone LG Nexus 5X from Google. Uh, this phone, as we all know, has been built for the masses. This is the and the battery on this phone is supposed to be very good. It's a 2700 mAh battery, which is packed inside this sleek body. Uh, now let's see uh, what exactly the battery is all about. Before we go into the battery, we, let's talk about the charger. The phone comes packed with a quick charge charger from LG. As you can see, it's a bit different. The cable is a USB C type. It does not have the conventional USB uh, port, but it has a USB C type port on both ends. So, what does it essentially mean that uh, this comes with a USB C type charges on both ends? It means that you cannot charge your phone from your computer anymore, which all of us have been used to. It also means that uh, you will not be able to use just any USB uh, charger to charge your phone. You will have to carry this LG uh, charging unit always with you. Uh, it also means that you will not be able to share the cable, the charging cable from any of your friends at your workplace or during travel. And you will always have to carry one with you all times. At the same time, uh, there are some very big advantages of having this USB-C type on both ends. The biggest advantage is that this gives you the fast charge facility which means that you can charge your phone from almost zero to a significant amount in less than 10 minutes. To be very precise, 10 minutes of charging usage in this charger can give you a battery life of up to 4 hours. That is brilliant. No other charger can give you that. So uh, there are pros and cons both for this kind of a charger. But yes, uh, in the future, we see that most of the phones will have a charger like this. So probably this is the beginning for all of us. Now let's see how the battery on this uh, phone looks like. It's a 2700 mAh battery as I said earlier. Uh, let's go into the settings and analyze how the battery uh, lasts. Uh, from whatever I have used this phone in the past uh, couple of days, the battery is good enough to last me for the full day. It does not drain very quickly and uh, if you can see, I have 71% battery left which will give me approximately 10 hours of usage which is actually better than any of the other Android phones that I have used in the past and uh, before it goes into the battery saving mode which is at 15% uh, you can use it very nicely and as I said earlier even when the battery becomes low you can charge it for only 10 minutes and give you additional 4 hours of battery life you can get each and everything how uh, each of the functions has been using the battery on the phone and you can customize that according to your needs. If you just swipe, it will also tell you how much uh, mobile signal uh, has drained your battery. Uh, Wi-Fi, screen, charging, everything will come on the screen and it basically gives you a better battery life than any of the other phones available in the market. So in a nutshell, the battery backup is much better. The quick charge uh, on the phone makes it even uh, worthwhile. Uh, the cable, yes, is a problem right now, but I, I think we'll get used to it. Uh, so if you like the video, hit the like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.